Piers Morgan gave an incredible interview on Good Morning Britain this morning as he took on NRA campaigner Dan Roberts' gun laws, and the recent conference which was attended by President Trump and his son, Eric Trump. Dan appeared on the show to discuss U.S. During Donald Trump's visit to the NRA conference members of the public were not allowed to have any guns on their person at any point. Although Dan argued that this was standard protocol when the president arrives, Piers couldn't believe it. He was stunned when he found out that the NRA members were not allowed to have their guns in a specific room at the conference. Piers found this tidbit entirely ironic, and would not let Dan forget it. Clarifying the situation, Piers asked Dan. NRA members were banned from taking guns to the room where the president was. Is that correct? Dan confirmed this information and defended, it's standard secret service protocol. But Piers wasn't satisfied. As he continued, where does it say in the constitution, particularly in relation of the second amendment, that the secret service is allowed to ban guns in the presence of the president? I thought the wording of the Second Amendment of the U.S. Constitution was so sacrosanct, that your rights could never be infringed. It looks to me that your rights were infringed. Why weren't you leaping up and down demanding your right to bear arms at your own conference? Shame on you. Dan wasn't having any of it though, as he hit back. We believe every American has a birthright to bear arms at all times. We were given a choice to voluntarily enter the room with a president without arms and we had the choice to do that. Freedom is a wonderful thing. Your rights were infringed, Piers shouted, and you weren't allowed into the room with the President of the United States because you were banned. Dan denied this once again, and simply stated that he had no interest in seeing President Trump promote the NRA at the conference. Yesterday's edition of Good Morning Britain saw Ian Lee taking on Jeremy Clarkson. He announced, he's a good presenter but I don't buy everything he stands for. I don't buy the Clarkson myth. Good Morning Britain airs weekdays at 6am on.